Hey everyone. Thought I'd do a little update on the wild rats and uh, also give you an opportunity to meet the rest of my pets. Come on up, girls. Wanna come out? Come here. Come on. I see you. Hey, rats. What are you doing? You can come out and be sociable? You can come out? You can come out and be sociable? Me, so nice. Get out the treats. Come on, girls. Come on. There's Cookie. Hi, good. They're not being totally terribly sociable right now. These wild rats are getting old. They are two and a half years old now. The life expectancy of a wild rat, in the wild anyway, is about nine months. And some scientists that have kept them in captivity found they only live about a year and a half in captivity. So these ones have exceeded any expectations. I didn't have any expectations. I didn't know if I'd be able to keep them. Certainly didn't know if I'd be able to handle them. As you can see, they are very handleable. They don't seek out attention as much as domestic rats do, and they're very moody. Sometimes they don't want attention at all. Two days ago, they, I couldn't keep them off me. It was hilarious. I should have filmed them then. They were running all over me and everything. Come on, girls. That was Pino Lope, and this is Cookie. Yeah, they don't really want attention right now. And over here, this is Belle. Belle was a domestic rat, a fancy rat, but she was a mishandled classroom rat. I got her when she was maybe six months old, and as a result, she's not super friendly. She doesn't really seek it out all that much. She will shy away from you. She tolerates being held. I mean, she's a good rat. But she's not super cuddly. She had a cage mate until recently. Cage mate died a gigantic tumor. It happens. Fortunately, domestic rats are badly inbred. She's actually developing one herself. So. Hi, Belle. What are you doing? You're a good rat. I mean, she doesn't bite her anything. She just isn't super friendly. And then, of course, there's Hugo. Hi, buddy. What are you doing? Hmm? Where's my boy? He's a good dog. She is. You look so guilty. Pee someplace? Did you fart? I don't know. What's going on, buddy? Jelly Bean, the eternal kitten. She just doesn't grow. She's a tiny little cat. Yes, you're a tiny little cat. She's like 12 years old. She weighs six pounds. This is Lana. About five years ago, Lana just showed up here one day. Just decided one night she wanted to live here. She's been hanging around in the yard for a couple of weeks. Wouldn't want to, didn't want to come anywhere near us. She was a young cat, maybe a year old. And then one night, right before Christmas actually, she was just hanging on the door, screaming to come in. We let her in, and she's lived here ever since. Wonderful cat, nice hunter, does her job. It's a great job. She's the only cat that goes out. After about a year, she'd gotten out a couple of times, and after about a year, we figured out, well, she's got to be fixed because she doesn't go into heat, and she always comes back. So she wanted to be indoor, outdoor, so we let her go indoor, outdoor. The rest of my cats stay inside. Over here, hiding behind the stove, is Muffin! Hi, weirdo! You're very strange. You're a very strange cat. You're a nice kitty, but you're very weird. Anyway, that's the uh, family, so to speak. Making another batch of fire lighters. It's that time of the year again. There you go. I thought you should uh, eat the animals. Thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe, etc., etc. Yeah, she's being good. Get going. Hi. How you doing, Cookie?
case you're wondering why I don't put Belle in with them or vice versa, it's because Belle is kind of a bully. I have tried to introduce him a little bit and she acts very, very aggressive. We're just not going to do that. She's also about twice their size. Belle is a Dumbo rat. And they get to be about half again the size of a regular domestic rat. Maybe. This is how it is when she gets friendly. I can't keep her off. And there's Peter. Hello. That's weird. She doesn't usually run up my arm like that, but she will come out and happily get petted. No, like I said, they're getting old. I have no idea how long these two are going to last. They both have um, kind of crappy lungs right now. Rats carry mycoplasma, which is a bacteria, I think, that they all carry. And uh, usually in a healthy animal, it's under control. But in older or weaker animals, it can start to become you know, a problem and causes pneumonia. They both have a little wheeze, treating them both with antibiotics right now. The pets are off with these guys. I didn't know if they'd last to adulthood. No. The fact that they're still going two and a half years later it just blows me away. And the fact that they're this friendly is just amazing. Hi Pino Cookie. I'm sorry, that's Cookie. I mean, that's cookie here and Pino Lope's the one. Hanging around. You two. You two are something else. But you are. POV hat for like the first real time too. I'm not sure how well I'm keeping them in frame because this camera's so close to me. It's kind of a blur when I'm seeing it. I see a little brown moving thing and I think that's good. I do know though. There you go, that's how moody they are. That other clip I took 10 minutes ago, and now all they want is attention. <laughs> As you can see, they've got food. If I offer them treats right now, they'll walk right past them and still come for attention. They don't want food right now, they want treats. I mean, they want attention. Don't you? Hey, <laughs> Pino. <laughs> so funny. Go bite the camera. Well, there you go. <laughs> Thanks for watching, folks.